No elbows on the table. Don't slurp your soup. Flush the toilet every time you go. These are some rules we live by to keep us civilized. We call this etiquette. Today we will discuss some of the rules we follow of etiquette in bowling. Coming up next on The Art of Bowling. Hi, I'm USBC Silver Certified Coach Arthur O'Connor. Here on The Art of Bowling, we discuss tips, tricks, and techniques to help improve your bowling scores. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss another episode. Bowling etiquette is a set of written and unwritten rules by which every bowler should follow. Yes, some of it has to do with sportsmanship, but some of the rules of bowling etiquette are focused around safety. First, don't ever go on the approach with your street shoes, especially if they're wet from rain or snow. If you're new to bowling, know that controlled sliding is an important part of the game, and any liquid or dirt on the approach can cause unexpected sticking or slipping, and can cause a bowler to lose their footing or even fall over when bowling. Keep your non-bowling shoes off the approach, and if they're wet, keep them out of the settee area altogether. When it's your turn to bowl, make sure no one is on the approach, ready to throw on either side of you. And if it's not your turn to bowl, please don't stand on the approach. I get it. It's exciting and fun to watch your friends bowl, and you're up there for support. Realize your friend is carrying a heavy bowling ball and swinging it, possibly wildly. Ever see somebody have the bowling ball slip out and fly in the opposite direction? Not good times, especially if it hits you. Now when you're on the approach ready to bowl, you'd appreciate personal space to do your thing. Give that space to others when it's their turn. Most leagues give the bowler to the right the courtesy to go first. In line with this idea, try not to cross over into other people's lanes, also known as running out your shot. Be mindful of how long you're taking to set up and deliver your shot. It's beneficial to have a pre-shot routine, but it shouldn't be lengthy. The amount of time it takes to get through a league night has increased dramatically. When it's your turn, be up on the lanes. This probably goes without saying, but you'd be surprised. Please don't make any distracting noises get, that can throw off a bowler. It's rude, unsportsmanlike, and just not cool. When the game is over, don't forget to be a good sport. Shake the other team's hand for a good game. Win or lose, your attitude should reflect that of a good sportsman. If you knew any of these rules of etiquette, hit that like button. If there's anything that agitates you that we left out, please leave a comment below. That's all for this week. Thanks for watching and see you on the lanes.